All of these vessels took place, took part in, in the Battle of Lake Erie this last weekend. That was over Labor, on Labor Day uh, up in Putnam Bay, Ohio. We had 16 tall ships involved, and we had over 2,000 recreational boats in the audience. In fact, the only way you could have seen the Battle of Lake Erie reenacted was from a ship, as the entire battle took place over six miles off shore. Now we see the Great Niagara coming about. That means it'll come back closer to us? Yeah. Wow. Absolutely beautiful day. Also, I have to point out that it is very rare to see a parade sail where all the vessels are sailing, or most of the vessels are sailing, because they're all rigged slightly differently. We have square rigged ships, which are fairly easy to identify as their sails are square, and other ships that are basically fore and aft rigged. That means that their sails run pretty much along the center line of the vessel. So fore and aft along the center line, square rig, perpendicular to that center line usually, and in a square Sorry. shape. And coming in front of the Bicentennial Tower, and soon into your view, is the Appledore 4, sponsored by Local Edge. Appledore 4 is a scooter. It was designed by Bud McIntosh and built at the Georgia Yacht Yard in Palm Coast, Florida, in 1989. Today she's owned and operated by Baysail, a not-for-profit corporation out of Bay City, Michigan. But originally, she was owned by a couple who had built five apple doors all together. And what they did basically is they would buy a ship, they would sail her around the world, sell her, build another ship, sail her around the world, build another ship, sail her around the world. You get the idea. Appledore 4 was the one Appledore that did not circumnavigate. She got as far as Barbados and decided that island life was just the thing for her. So, for a number of years she operated out of Barbados, around the Caribbean, and up to Maine. Today, she sailed out of Bay City once again with Bay Sales, the not-for-profit corporation that takes K-12 students on uh, environmental education programs, or what they call Science Under Sail. In the past few years, she's taken over 30 thousand students onto the lakes and has done extensive environmental education and sail training. Appledore 4 is 85 feet overall and a beam of 18 feet 5 inches. Her mid height is 76 feet and she can put up 3,500 square feet of sail.